Hello, and welcome to Built and Deployed, where we talk with Oracle Cloud infrastructure users about their cloud architecture. My name is Kranti Manchikanti, and I'm a cloud architect with Oracle. Today, I'm here with Saurabh Narula, Director of Software Engineering at Electrify. We are here to talk about how Saurabh and the team built and deployed their machine learning applications on OCI. Could you tell us a little bit more about your company and your role? So at Electrify, uh, we provide pre-built machine learning uh, models and solutions to organizations that really want to accelerate their time to value with, with artificial intelligence. We can tune models to their business rules, requirements, uh, you know, whether it's, it's a custom use case or a new use case. I lead infrastructure and cloud uh, team as part of the engineering team. Uh, we work with data science and, and business teams to build machine learning models and put them in production, whether it's as part of packages, model packages, or Docker images, um, or as, as standalone VMs or SaaS products uh, on Kubernetes cluster deployed as microservices or as part of our, our in-house machine learning as service platform. Thank you, Saurabh. Uh, can we dig deeper into the Spend AI application architecture on OCI? So our Spend AI application is a SaaS offering. It is currently deployed on OCI. It has two main components. Uh, one is the data pipeline. And the second is the UI uh, solution, which is uh, a BI application, which is built using Sysense. Uh, in terms of infrastructure, uh, we leverage uh, different availability domains. Uh, we have three, three availability domains. Uh, the first one has uh, a subnet for, our, for the load balancer, as you can see. And then we have a public subnet where we host our bastion. Uh, when end users log in, they, they go via the load balancer, which then exposes uh, the Sysense front end as well as uh, the Spend AI front end. Our dashboards are built using uh, Sysense. So we use Sysense uh, embedded capabilities where we can create dashboards in Sysense and then embed them in, in our own Spend AI UI. On the back end side, we, uh, in terms of our database storage, uh, we use uh, MySQL. Uh, we are also very, uh, uh, very closely looking at possibly migrating MySQL to Heatwave and start leveraging Heatwave, uh, Heatwave uh, in-memory capabilities and and other other features and and, and capabilities that Heatwave has has to offer. Uh, we are currently evaluating Heatwave in terms of uh, our data pipelines. Uh, we have we are running Airflow. Uh, in a self-managed manner on OCI, and we submit Spark jobs through our Airflow DAX uh, using Dataflow. Fantastic, fantastic, Saurabh. I think uh, I'm excited for all of this. Thank you so much. So, yeah, if you don't mind, what drove the decision to migrate, you know, these uh, Spend AI application to uh, OCI? Sure, that's a great question. So, um, Oracle is is our one of our strongest uh, partners at Electrify, and we wanted to offer uh, our pre-built machine learning models uh, onto OCI, and that really led us uh, to to select Spend AI as one of our SaaS product offerings um, to to uh, you know to migrate to Oracle and then provide support for Oracle. So, um, I mean, our our intent was really uh, to to have the, the the right deployments and and the right infrastructure available for OCI so that. Uh, when the need arises, we we can deploy our spend solution, uh, spend AI solution really quickly, and and you know we also plan to offer, uh, as you know, our contract AI solution along with spend AI, so that our customers uh, can have a 360, 360 degree view of their of their spend data at at transaction level integrated with with contract AI. Um, and, and there are other package solution offerings uh, that we are looking to integrate with, such as EBS, Edenus uh, Suite. So that's also that we 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 are that at Electrify we are very interested in. Awesome, thank you, Saurabh. Thank you so much. Yeah, one last question. So, what's next for your company with OCI? Sure. So we would definitely continue to accelerate um, our mission of applied AI uh, and and provide support for our machine learning models across different solution offerings at OCI. Uh, we also want to, as, as I mentioned, uh, deploy contract AI end-to-end -end and, and provide an integrated uh, solution offering uh, with Spend AI and contract AI and OCI. 
Uh, we can use uh, data uh, from OCI, we can train our models, um, uh, we can deploy them in, in different ways, as I mentioned uh, previously, whether it's a, it's a machine learning as a platform serving uh, a solution offering uh, deployed on OCI, or, or it can be a SaaS solution such as Spend AI, or, or it can be a, a standalone VM, uh, which has uh, our Docker images, our, our Docker images running. So, uh, whatever deployment option we we are we are open open to that. Um, we we some of the important use cases that I would like to mention are churn mitigation, um, you know, account receivables and collections and demand forecasting. You know, these are some of the use cases for which we already have pre-built machine learning models. So we we are happy to work uh, on on these uh, group of models and and target target a broader. ML opportunity with 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 Oracle customers and and uh, and yeah really really looking forward to our partnership uh, in the future. Great, thank you so much, Saurabh. Uh, thanks for joining me today. This has been built and deployed. Thank you for joining us and stay tuned for more technical customer conversations.